Have you ever wondered, what would life be like without electricity? Well, I'm stood next to one of my favourite electricity demos here at Wonder Lab at the Science Museum. This is David, who is in charge. Um, tell us more. Well, this is the Van de Graaff generator, which is named after the American physicist. And it's a bit like when you rub a balloon on your head and your hair stands on end, but we're doing it on a massive scale here. Um, we're generating so much electricity here, we can get some sparks. Would you like to see some? Yeah, okay, absolutely. Let's, let's see if we can get some off here. Oh, yes. And you can see the hair's reacting <laughs> I love the too. hair dancing. So that's that electricity jumping through the air, isn't it? And causing a spark and then making its way to the ground. But here's the thing, David, all right? I, I do love it, it's one of my favorites, but I've also spotted this. Well, you're right to spot this, Greg, because this is our amazing Tesla coil. Over here with the Van de Graaff, we can generate a load of electricity, but here we can generate a million volts. I want to see it. Okay. Can we? we absolutely, but first, it's very loud, so we need to put some ear protection on. Okay. So let's get our ear protectors on. Sure. And here we go. Let's go. I'm ready. Three, two, what? one. Oh, yes. That's what we're talking about. It's awesome, isn't it? That was amazing. Is it actually useful for anything? No, not at all. No. But you know what? It generates electricity. And electricity is very, very useful because it's something we use every day in our phones, in our computers, in buildings like here in the Science Museum as well. With electricity playing such an important role in our everyday lives, it's easy to take it for granted. But think about this. Just a hundred years ago, hardly any homes in Britain had an electricity supply. And even today, more than a billion people in the world don't have electricity supplied to their homes. Have you ever stopped and wondered what your life would be like without electricity? Could you cope? What would you do to entertain yourself after school? And are there any downsides to using electricity? Why not come up with some ideas for what you do to light your home or to keep your food fresh if you didn't have any electricity? You could have a look at films for inspiration or do an online search or check out some old paintings to see how it used to be done. Oh, no, no, no.